Wordsmith has a lot of terrific resources for teaching vocabulary. Now, the free subscription doesn't actually have a ton, but the individual subscription is only $9.95 a year. And they also have um, good discounts for educational groups or Title I schools. So I'm going to show you one feature. The multiple choice quiz is a great way to shorten the amount of time it takes to make assessments. So you wanna choose a dictionary to use for your quiz. I've cho chosen beginners, always use beginners. And then I have pasted in the vocabulary from the unit I'm working on right now. Now you have a choice between definition and example. If I'm only going to use one, I would always use example. It is easier for kids to get the sense of the meaning of a new word by example more than definition usually. Now, one thing that's really good about Wordsmith is that their definitions and their examples are well controlled for other vocabulary. So I find them very easy for learners of English and kids who don't have a big vocabulary to access. So we click next. And then I usually custom select the definitions. And then I've already gone and just done this. Um, so you wanna check the sense that you want to include in your text. And I usually um, pick ones that are very similar to the sense that we had in the article that we read. Okay, so I do that, I go next. Next. Okay, now you could uh, play this online, but actually what I most often do with this is I actually just split my screen like this and I use the examples um, to make myself a Kahoot. So here's a Kahoot and I copy this. Just copy the answers, or sometimes I type them, but just not having to start from scratch and think of it on your own, it makes it so much faster. And then I might make myself a picture for this, um, but you get the idea. So I have here a bank that I can use to make um, questions in my Kahoot very quickly. Now, before when I picked example, you can also pick um, definition. So I could use a mixture of definitions and examples. And I will tell you what, no matter what we read um, during the week on Friday, it's a tradition in my class to have a vocabulary Kahoot. So we're going to revisit the vocabulary that we've had during the week. And it's an assessment. If I have kids put their real name that they play with, I have um, the ability to see who got what questions right, but kids don't feel like they're taking a test. They feel like they're playing a game. So Wordsmith and Kahoot is a great combination. Hope this has been helpful. Thank you.